All right, so I was born November 10, 2000, and realized I could not draw babies here. And Dylan was born in April 20, in 2000, but obviously didn't know he was born at the time. Um, we were both born in Michigan, Holland, Michigan, and then I um, lived in Zealand my whole life, and Dylan actually moved to Tennessee for a part of his life. I was obsessed with babies when I was younger, played with them all the time, and I was also obsessed with my four siblings. We were all best friends because we were all homeschooled and just hung out all day long. Um, about sixth grade, I actually was going to a school and had to transfer schools to my new school, and I absolutely hated it. This year was my eighth grade year, and it sucked. I had no friends and just totally, totally felt alone. But I did have one best friend, she was my childhood best friend, I've known her ever since I was three and we're actually still friends today. And a lot of my life consists of babysitting my cousins, they had five kids and we often played outside, rode bikes, we liked to play zoo and just play pretend all the time. And my little sister always came along so it always felt like I was babysitting six kids. Um, my first real job was actually at a bagel shop and I did that for about a year and a half. Um, there was one time there that I cut myself with a knife pretty bad and had to go get four stitches in my hand. I still have a scar from that. My second job was at a pizza place and I really, really, really love this job but I also got burned there and also have a scar from that. Um, I graduated in 2019 and from there decided to go to nursing school for one semester. This is my drawing of a backpack and just really wasn't a fan of school and didn't think this is what I wanted. Dylan, he, um, most of his younger years was in Tennessee. That's his trailer in the back with the pond. He had his siblings and then his two cousins that also lived nearby that they were really good friends. He was also homeschooled for a majority of his life and my favorite story of him being in Tennessee was when he was getting sunk in the mud and had to yell for help and no one heard him and he thought he was going to die. Um, he also really enjoyed animals and turtles and also has turtles right now. And he had to move from Tennessee to Michigan, obviously. This was about 8th grade year and then moved up freshman year. And he was very, very, very alone freshman year until he met me his sophomore year. And that is when everything changed. And this was in 2014. And our love began then and just kept going out through high school. Um, Dylan really, really loved sports and played lacrosse in high school, and I tried to go as many games as I could. That's me cheering him on in the back. This is Dylan drawing now. He is drawing his first job. He also he got an internship through school at a company, um, engineering company, and they ended up offering him a job. So this is him having to sit down with his boss. And then, also, cool thing about Dylan, he's really smart. He made the newspaper twice, once for sports and one for cleaning up um, some yard or something. I forget. Um, and then he was also on a science Olympiad team at school and made robots and controlled them. He graduated in 2018, a year before me, and is still going to college. He doesn't like it, that's why I exit out. And um, November of last year, that's when we got engaged. So adorable after dating for three years. And I've known him for four. Now, this is me. I work as a CNA. That's my badge. That's me. And then this is one of my residents that I drew in their little wheelchair. We absolutely love each other. And this is us preparing for our wedding come June 27. I did do the outro and it's really bright out. But I just want to say thank you for watching today's video and hope you have a good day. Bye. Say bye. Bye. Why am I?